now, now I'm recording. Now, uh, now I'm supposed to say, hello, everybody. <laughs> This is Brendan. This is another one of my Cleveland friends who has so graciously volunteered out of the pack of eight of us to drive me back up the mountain. Yeah, they're all at a brewery drinking right now. We must like Amelia. Yeah. Get her hair. <laughs> and um, we picked up Adam. Yay! So we'll be hiking again today. Uh, we heard that Powder King is not too far ahead of us, so we should catch up with him tonight. And uh, yeah, it was sunny and chilly but sunny and nice in Asheville and now we're driving in the rain. Can't wait to go hiking in the rain. Yay. It's gonna be great. Go crazy. <laughs> but we love Brendan for driving us. Thank you Happy very much. Oh, we're yeah. in Tennessee again and it's raining. Mm. Yay. <laughs> All right, finally, after however many hours we delayed since we got dropped off here, it's not really raining. It's just really cold. And we're finally getting back on the trail. We have, it's almost 4.30. <laughs> we should be sleeping in a shelter already, but we're just now starting our day. Okay. It'll be fine. It'll be great. It's all gonna be fine. That pillow will be warm soon. Yeah, we do have, we have like seven miles of uphill. So, it'll be fine. Hooray. Hooray. I don't know when this happened. We just limboed under this tree. Yeah. And uh, this is what we get to walk through right now. <laughs> the trail's buried here under all of these trees that apparently have fallen down in the last day or two. I don't know, it smells pretty fresh. Look at all this. Yay! Oh my gosh. This is super fun. It's an adventure. This is like the only bushwhack on the AT so More far. Tree whacking. Tree whacking. I'm sure there's more to come. Yeah. Well, after this storm, wow, we get to limbo again. I don't think there's a way over this one. Don't start raining. So we think this tree fell over and knocked down this tree, which fell over and knocked down that tree and broke all these other trees. So that is what we just hiked through. That's, the trail is in there, I promise. Just buried. Now we're going this way. It's sleeting. Yeah. Sleet, not rain, but sleet. <laughs> this is kind of cool. out of the forest into a cloud and a bald. This thing is so creepy. Came out of the woods. Yeah, that's the trail we just came down out of the woods. Yeah, it's creepy. It's also like kind of late to be hiking even though it's light out. This thing looks like a freaking spaceship. Apparently this is an FAA tower that we can't. <laughs> oh my gosh, so creepy. Kind of cool though. Wow. Good morning. We, Adam and I arrived to wherever we are uh, just before sunset last night and uh, 
hiked a little bit through the rain and the sleet. Um, I had to crawl, hop, jump, skip over some trees. Apparently there was a really bad windstorm here while we were in town. And uh, it's cold, so I'm avoiding getting up. It's well past hiking time, and uh, I don't want to move. So, but we're also waiting for the sun to come out and dry out our tents because they're very wet. Anyway, today we're pushing, I think, 13 miles, and then same thing tomorrow, and we'll get into hot springs. So, yay! That's all for now. It has a white blaze on the fence. Yeah, but it wasn't. Yeah, it's this way. We are coming up to Max Patch. Wow. Look at the views. Oh boy. Holy cow. It goes way up there. <laughs> oh gosh. This is a little bit longer of a hike than I thought it was going to be. At least we have stairs to walk up. So we're here. What's st Oh yeah, there's stairs there. Going way over there by those hikers. <laughs> we're at Max Patch. So I am uh, up here at the top of a ball that's right before the shelter. I came up here to make a phone call because this seems to be the only place to get an okay signal. And um, behind me, the sun is setting and lighting the sky on fire and it is absolutely gorgeous. I'm so glad that I had to come up here otherwise I'd be hiding in my sleeping bag in the shelter right now but it's beautiful. Uh, today we hiked uh, 13 point something miles. We went over Max Patch. Um, it was freezing and windy as it is now. So we rushed over the patch to the other side and found a spot that was shaded from the wind and also in the sunshine to have lunch. Um, Powder King caught up with Adam and I, and so the three of us are kind of hiking together again. His knees are still bothering him. I have my shoes back, um, and my feet feel 
pretty, I can feel that I'm going to get hot spots again, which is okay. Um, but I feel like my knee is getting a little bit better. I was definitely grateful to have my shoes today because the trail is a little wet still from all the rain that we've been getting up here. Uh, there's lots of downed trees. Apparently there was a huge windstorm while I was in town for the wedding and there are brand new giant trees all over the trail uh, yesterday and today. Tomorrow we're doing another push, uh, another 13 point something into hot springs. So hopefully tomorrow night, maybe we'll go sit in a hot spring. <laughs> right now it sounds amazing because I'm freezing, but um, yeah, we'll resupply there and then we'll push on again the next day. So got to keep trekking now that we've taken all these zeros for injuries. Hopefully we're all over our injuries for the most part and uh, can keep going because trail days is in less than two weeks and I'm, I'm hoping to get there. I'll probably have to pitch, but hoping to get to trail days. So we'll check in with you tomorrow. Bye. Here is just another look at the sunset with the better camera. So beautiful. Also very windy and cold. So this is about the last look we're gonna get before we go down and go to bed. Good night, everyone.